Hello, my friends, and welcome back to Let's Build Newcrest. With me, your host, Mr. Devon Bumpkin. I'm sorry. Here we go. <laughs> Already failing, and I'm not going to edit it. Not at all. Welcome, my loves. Welcome to Let's Build Newcrest. <laughs> I don't know what that was about. But anyway, we're here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. We're going to shuffle on over to where we're going to be working today. We're going to be building the Starbucks today. So as you know, I really wanted it next to the um, antique shop that we built like two builds ago. Yeah, two builds ago. We kind of, we went around here and we did the um, laundrette and we did the salon as well. We're going to try and fit two more little mini builds in here. Obviously, we're going to be doing a florist here. And here, I'm unsure as to what we're going to be doing yet. And then we're going to get the community garden. But what I'm going to do is probably build the florist and the community garden in a one. Because they kind of mirror each other. And I'm thinking maybe the florist actually owns the community garden. Uh, so it's where she grows all of her flowers and whatnot. And But she allows the community to come in and um, do like flower arranging classes and stuff. That was just little thought of what I had um what was I going to say and I was going to get your opinions because obviously this is going to be the commercial kind of community area and I'm unsure of what to do here main reasons being I don't want this area to be too laggy for you lot it already is kind of struggling a little bit even with my computer my computer is um quite powerful um, so I'm unsure I want to put what I want to do here. And this is quite a big lot. This is probably the same size. As, no, this, this is bigger. I think this is the 30 by 30 lot. Yeah, it is. It's the 30 by 30 lot. So I don't really want to over detail it. So I'm going to get some thoughts on that from you guys. Um, but anyway, today we're going to be building the Starbucks. We're going to be concentrating on the exterior in this part. And then the interior will be the next part that comes out. So... I actually stole an idea off of my dear friend, um, Simproved, or AKA Fry. She made an amazing CC free Starbucks. And she actually used these signage um, as the logo itself. Like this kind of sort of looks like the Starbucks sign. And I, I was just like, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to steal that off you, Fry. So I hope you don't mind. I hope you don't mind, my darling. I will obviously credit you and your build I will put down below because it's amazing. You need to go and check it out if you haven't already. She did the whole Starbucks Cafe CC3 and it was amazing. So yeah, go down go down and have a little look down below if you want to go and see Fry's build. I would implore you to do so because it is absolutely incredible. Incredible. Now, I'm going to pull this build just back to maybe three look at how far is that that's quite far we'll do two we'll do two um i'm gonna pull it back two more squares than the kind of frontage of that one main reasons being i do want to put a couple of table and chairs just outside here um with this build we're going to go up two stories as well so there will be seating upstairs too the shape is going to be pretty generic i'm going to um make it very square like the rest of them but i'm not going to do it let me just, in fact, let me just grab out the, oh, what did it come with? It came with get together. It came with get together. I'm going to get the barista station out just so I can see the size of it. And then I can get the dimensions and stuff down probably. Where are you? I do not see you. Where are you, my love? There you are. Oh, so it's quite small. Oh, but I do want to do kind of a long counter moment. Now, where am I going to want? The entrance is here. So I would like maybe seating up this way. And then we'll put the stairs over here, maybe. So it would make sense to have the kind of barista. I do want a kitchen as well, though. Um, Maybe if I'd put you there for the minute. We're going to change up the styling of this. This is going to be very kind of your average looking Starbucks build as well. Or Starbucks... Um cafe i say build for everything i i think you know that all by now it's very silly of me um okay so let me just get some stairs creeping on in now i have seen these stairs in the starbucks before but i'm thinking of sticking with maybe a wood like a wooden moment 
Let's have a look at you. It, do you come in a darker one per chance? That is... Oh, no, that, that's darker. It's darker and a little bit more flatter. I wouldn't mind, like, a double moment in this build. Um... Let me try it the, in another orientation just to get a feel for it. Yeah, I think that would work a little bit better, actually. Would work a little bit better. Now, we've got enough space out here for a garden. We'll probably sit it the same amount as what we've done back here. But we're going to have a kind of a low-level fence. And then they can look out over the community garden. And that would be quite cute. So maybe I do need to move this back just one. Okay. That's not leaving me enough space for a kitchen, though. Not by any means. Um, maybe we'll skip out on the kitchen idea, but they do have like a back area in Starbucks. That's the only problem. Hmm. This is going to be a little bit more difficult than what I thought. Just with the space that I've got, it's not the hugest amount of space. Not the hugest amount of space at all. I'm just wondering if this is a little bit too wide. Mm, no, I'm thinking it'd be all right. Now, I'm thinking about going um, kind of traditional with this build itself. Keeping it very... It's just so it mirrors on this like sort of edge of the street. I think it would look quite nice if it was traditional. But then with some sort of like uh, modernist kind of or modern-ish elements with the windows just on the front area. So I'm thinking I'm going to overhang the top, actually. I'm going to overhang the top just slightly. Yeah, that's better. That will give me the look I want. Stunning! Yeah, I think so. Yeah, I do believe so. And I think we're going to go kind of Tudor-esque with this one. Maybe a little bit Tudor-esque. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Okay. Anyway, let's get to building, shall we? I'm thinking maybe doing like a a roof in this kind of orientation. Do we want to tuck those flaps in? We do. No one likes an exposed flap. Yes, that's kind of the right height that I'm thinking as well. I am going to be doing another roof as well coming through this way. I maybe want to use a hipped roof. Let's have a look. Let's have a look at this. I can see this arrow. Oh, if you notice the lighting going weird as well, it's because it's really sunny at the minute. And in the spare bedroom that I'm in at the minute, the window is literally directly behind me. So apologies for the shitty lighting today, my darlings. I hope you've all had a good weekend. I really do. Um, I've had a nice weekend. We've just been decorating. Decorating, getting the finishing touches on. The paint's on the wall at last. It looks great. The green looks so nice. I'm so glad we went for the green that we did. And it's... I'm just waiting now until everything opens back up again before we can do anything more. Uh, let's have a look, a little look at that. I mean, that's not too bad. I do actually think I want to come up a little bit higher with this. Let's have a look. Uh, maybe up to the top. Let's see what that would look like. Is that the top? No, it's a little bit too high. Uh, maybe there. Have a look. Yeah, I think so. But I think what I'm going to do is just, just shape the roof around slightly just to make it look a little bit more interesting. And I think I'll do the same with this here as well. Just to make it a little bit more sexy. And then just bulb the top out. Not like that. God, I wish they would fix these roofs. I really do. It's not working again. And then it goes too much. Let's have a look at that. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. I will take it. Yeah, I think so. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. And the, I'm thinking with the windows. Please don't. Uh, oh, it does fit in the middle. Great. I'm thinking about using something like that there. Not in that tone, though. It's too... It needs to be quite dark. Quite dark. I'm thinking like Bath, which is a city in the UK. Um, I'm thinking kind of like a... a like a Tudor-esque Bath build. That's quite nice. I think that might work, actually. Yeah, I think so. I think we'll do that. We'll leave that on there for the minute. 
And I'm thinking about doing maybe two more down these sides here. And I'm just debating on whether it will fit in okay. Let's have a look. Oh, it does. Yeah. Yeah, it does. Okay. So you guys are probably looking at this thinking, that doesn't look like a Starbucks. But Starbucks in the UK is like housed in so many really interesting... Um, like buildings like i've seen like some amazing starbucks and i'm not really i wouldn't say i'm a huge fan of starbucks i prefer to get from like independent coffee shops and stuff but i do i am partial we shall say very partial to a starbucks i am okay okay Right, anyway, let's maybe get in some of... Do they come in like a... I want a green one. I'm just thinking. I think this one here does have a green. Oh, it does. The green stripey one. <gasps> oh, can I size that up without it looking strange? I don't hate that. I know it's clipping through that top bit there. But I don't actually detest that. It's not going to give me any space to leave a... To get the Starbucks kind of print in. But I could maybe do that somewhere else yeah i don't hate that at all right let's find the matching wallpapers to this anyway these are from get together really lovely wallpapers i'd love to see some more like traditional kind of tudor-esque wallpapers in the game this was the kind of last installment they ever did is it that one no it's not that one it's this one i think yes yeah, this one is it no because that color in the middle is a little bit different maybe it's Nope, not that one either. What about you? There, there's that one. Okay. And then we'll go in a formation of... If I can do that one. And then we'll get this one here. Marry it on over to this side. And then we'll... I think I'll use this one here at the top. Like, uh, like there. Yes. And then I'll get in... Yep, yeah, little... Little crisscross moment there, lovely. Um, and in the middle, we'll just do the. I could do another one of those in the middle, just so it blends in, lovely. Is that the right one for this one? It certainly is, Asian. It certainly is. Yeah, that looks kind of cute. That does look kind of cute there. I think we're going to do a window up there as well. Going to do a little window up there. I'm thinking just down below, we'll do the same is that the right shape no nope, no nope. color even i think it's that one isn't it yes yeah, that one and then the bottom ones would do the stone detail all the way along all the way along sweetie oh that trims needs to go from over there yeah i think so i do i do think so yes right now we're gonna go here is that right nope so it needs to go oh oh, oh. no silly <laughs> Silly bum. Right, there we go. And then what I'm going to do is just do it on either one, like so. I love when I see a build with these kind of wallpapers used correctly. It makes me absolutely 100% moist. Oh, that's still going to look weird. I suppose we need to do it the same as what we have did on the front at the back there. Whereas this side here, we can kind of just... Yeah, we can kind of frame them this way. Oh, look, a lovely little diamond shape creeped out then. Absolutely lovely. Oh, oh, that's a different shape there, though, to there. Oh, well. Oh, well. Stunning. Yes, okay, right. So we'll do that in the middle. That might have to change now on the outside. But this one kind of points towards... Yeah, so that's wrong there. That is wrong, but we're just going to have to do it as it is at the front. Because this this here kind of points towards uh, where we want to go. And uh, Is it that one? Yeah. No. Yeah. Yep. And then that one points there. And then we'll get this one. I don't know why I was going around the front to get the wallpaper when it's here. Oh, there we are. Look. Bloody lovely. Absolutely bloody lovely. Yeah, this is cute. Nice little Tudor-esque build. Yeah, lovely. Okay, right. Let's try and pick a window for at the top here. Thinking, ooh. 
Oh, you bugger. Well, the small one would. Oh, that doesn't look too bad. Obviously not in that colour. Oh, these come in some really crappy... I know it's all neutral colour tones, but I wish they came in some different ones. I really do. No, that's not going to work. Um, Maybe sticking with that family of windows. But there, that's not going to work because that's a two. It has got a one of that though, hasn't it? Um, I always struggle at finding this one. Oh, it's right there. Huh. Yeah, I think that's going to work the best. Oh, stunning. Oh, stunning. Yeah, okay. Okay, right. Trim wise, we'll do a big thick boy. Matching in that color tone. Lovely. All the way along, sweetie. Are you going to go right across there? Oh, no, you're not. Lovely. Just what I want to see. Sorry, I am touching my face and I am itching my eye, but I have washed my hands. I'm being very careful these days. Yeah. Yeah, that's the kind of, like, vibe I think would look really nice there. It's a mixture of, like, builds going on. So this is obviously a lot older than what these would be. These would be kind of semi-Victorian. Um, there would have been maybe more Victorian builds here, but they got bombed in the war. And this one would have been an original Tudor at Starbucks for... I'll have that, thank you. What an, uh, no, they're not going to go that. They have got grey ones, though. They have, haven't they? Yeah, that one there. I mean, that doesn't look hideous. It doesn't. But I'm thinking if it was Tudor, they would keep the original windows there. They wouldn't want to get rid of... They would not want to get rid of the original windows. They wouldn't be allowed to get rid of the original windows. So maybe choosing these in the grey. Do could I could do two there and do like a double entrance on this side. Because we have got a two wide path there. Um maybe I could size that down. I think that might be a little bit too big now, sized up. Uh, oh, it's not giving me that look, though, from the front. No, I kind of prefer it big there. Mm-hmm. And I might have to do the same here, but that's going to look weird on this side, isn't it? Yeah, that looks... I don't... I don't know. I don't... I actually hate that. I thought I was going to really detest that then. Do I want to take it there? No, we'll take it... Directly underneath that window there, so it's balanced. And we'll do another one just here as well. Yeah, that's kind of cute. I'm kind of there for that. And I'm thinking maybe putting them down to the floor. No. No, 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 no. Don't be so silly. That's not balanced. Let's shuffle you along. Just because I do... I need to get a door on that bit. But we're going to use the shorter door. So maybe it won't clip into this like little bit there. Let's have a look. Let's have a look, shall we? Modern doors it needs to be, really. Um, Some like glass numbers. I mean, that looks very Starbucks. <laughs> very Starbucks-y, that. Oh, I don't hate that. Do you come in a darker grey? You don't. What about the black? Would that? Oh, that fits quite well. Oh, what I was thinking, like doing them like that, you know? But then it makes that look weird. Um, have a look. I kind of like that, though. I don't want to... I think what's throwing me off is the fact that this is kind of... What about if I pulled this out one? Oh, then it's going to look weird from that side. But I could sort that out by doing this. I could, like, pocket this in just for the minute. And then just pull that out off the top. Or over one. Oh, I'm kind of there for that at the minute. Might change, but at the minute I'm kind of there for it. Uh, is that right there? Yeah. I need a diamond and a... Oh, that's a cross. That's a diamond. I'm on about this. This is like a diamond shape. So, um, nope, that's completely the one you just picked, Aiden, you silly bum. Nope, we'll keep it like that. It's fine. It's fine. 
And I'm thinking now that we've pulled that out, we don't need two of them. I can just put one kind of in the middle. Let me have a look. I know this roof line will have to change a little bit now. Um, and maybe, oh, it's difficult. Let me put a roof line on here first and then I'll make a decision on what to do. Let's have a little flop, flop that in like a, like so. And then we'll meander this down. And then maybe just, in fact, bring it up just a touch and just pull it out just. What is going on? Look, this. Oh. I'm not going to touch that at the minute <laughs> because that just pissed me off a little bit then. The fact that these roofs have not been fixed yet make me fume. Um, I mean, that is giving me two to vibes. It really is. Let me try again. See if it's still being an asshole. No, it's finally not. I mean, obviously, we're going to be doing the uh, corbels like, underneath. Mm. I'm still not enjoying the fact that this comes over. Stick you up there instead. What about if I... Oh, it's not going to stick to the trim. I mean, the freeze. I really like the bigger look of it, but it's just... I don't know. It's being weird. Let's get that signage. In fact, we're going to keep them smaller. We're going to keep them smaller. I liked them how they were looking. Oh, they're not going to fit in properly there now either. So maybe just one. And then we'll do one on each kind of area here. One there. Maybe just below where we've put the, the bits and bobs. Is that going to look weird right next to the door? No, it's fine. And then we can do the signage just above the door. Like so. I don't enjoy that. I wonder if we've got any better ones than those. Let's have a look. Let me have a gander. Let me have a goose. Right. Uh, what, what do you come in? You come in a green as well. I mean, that doesn't... So, that's a really cool kind of colour. It doesn't scream Starbucks to me, though. I don't know, actually. I kind of... Let me try this. I'm trying it for science, my friends. Because I prefer the sizing of this one. It will fit up above the windows a lot more nicer. And then... Do it... Where was this one? Can we do it directly underneath of it? We can. Is that the same height? It is. Maybe I can do three of these. That's not in the middle there. That will be. And that one there. Do you know what? Oh, you're not underneath the window. Okay, well, we will balance them out properly. There we go. One, two, and three. And then I can put that one there. There. And there. Yeah, I kind of prefer that look. Don't you? Hmm, yeah, I think we do. I think I am going to do a signage up here. I'm going to I'm gonna do a little signage up there. So we're going to put one of these maybe like there and then shuffle that one in place just below it maybe. Yeah, I think so. And maybe a little flappy sign on the side. Do we have like a coffee sign? I'm sure we do. Um, Didn't it come with cats and dogs? Oh, it was this one. I mean, we could. And then what I can do here. Can we put them on that? Absolutely not. Oh, that would have been really cool. I mean, I could lift it up with a 9 key. I'm going to do that, but I'll do it off of camera because I might fume a bit. One second. 
Okay, that was a lot easier than what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> it really was. So yeah, we just lifted it up with the nine key and just put it on that sign as well. I just thought that looks really cute. Really cute. Um, Yeah, it's not too bad at all. I kind of like it. I do. I really like the look of this building. It needs some chimneys or maybe just one chimney like on this side. Yeah, maybe like one chimney on this side. Oh, let me get comfy. And then we'll start putting some chairs and tables on the outside. Maybe like just one chair in, with an umbrella. We'll have a look. We'll have a little look. Oh, ow. 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 Sorry, I just sat on myself a bit funny then. And it hurt. Guys, I've bought this massage pillow. I can't grab it at the minute because it's right over there. But I bought a massage pillow from Amazon. Oh my God, it's amazing. It like heats up and like needs your back. Honestly, I've been like... <laughs> I've had it on my office chair and I've just been like, oh my God, this is amazing. <laughs> this is so amazing. Yeah, I would thoroughly recommend it. And it was only like £30 as well. Uh, so yeah, little tip for you. If you... I don't suffer from back problems. I've just had a bit of a stiff back recently. Um, probably all the sitting down I'm doing, being in quarantine. Uh, but um, yeah, amazing. I thoroughly recommend it. No, this is not an ad and it's not sponsored. <laughs> I just thoroughly recommend it. I really do. Um, do we use one of these in the black and white, maybe? Or the green? Oh. I think bringing a bit of black here, and I'm thinking of bringing a bit of modernity. <laughs> Is that even a word? We don't know. Modernity? No, I don't think it is. Ah! Modernity. It's a nice word, though. I hope it's a word, because it's stunning. Absolutely stunning, that word. Um, Can I do two here? I think we might be able to do two here. I think we bloody will. I tell you. I do. Right, and I'm thinking maybe for the chairs. <laughs> I said it like that. Chairs. <laughs> maybe bringing in a bit of that industrial element to the outside of the build as well with these. Oh, I think we shall. I do. I would have loved to have put some more down here, but it's not going to make sense, like, having chairs blocking this pathway. So we're not going to. Yeah, that's cute. It's cute. I'm kind of not liking the way it looks too perfect, though. I think I'm going to just shuffle them around just ever so slightly. Just to give it a bit of... That's better. Bit of a lived-in feel, you know. Like it's been used. Used and abused. Um, here we go. Bit of pat, bit of mm, the rugs at the front there. Yeah, and a bin. A bin would look great here. Maybe something a little bit different to these, though. Maybe something just, yeah, like this. Like just there. Stunning! Okay, right, we're going to... Put the trims on now and we're going to start adding a bit more detail to the front with some corbels uh, underneath. Yeah, we'll start doing that. We'll start doing that, my darlings. We'll start doing that. Um, thank you for all your lovely comments on my last speed build as well. I had so much fun building that build. As you guys know, my favorite uh, way to build is modern. I love building modern architecture. Mark modern architecture is my shit. I love it. And I haven't done one on the channel for quite some time. So it was really nice to delve into modernity once again. I had a lovely time with some modernity. Right, okay. What corbels are these? Why don't we have these in the game? Hmm? It's like a mixture of that and them. Well, we're going to fucking copy you then, aren't we? Yes, right. Um... You? Are you the same tone? You are not. They are black, I think. No, they're not. Are you? I can't see. Let's zoom in and debate together. No, they're definitely a grey. I think it's just the lighting. They do look darker, though. 
I think what we'll do is just do it in a gray just to be safe. Just to be absolutely sure. We're going to size them up, maybe. Oh, Christ. That's a corbel and half, that one, darling. Oh, where's my floor gone? Oh, it's because of the uh, the trim. It's a thick boy. Yeah, that's too big. It's never too big. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Disgusting. Right, okay. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Next. Moving on. Moving on. Away from the filth, please. Away from the absolute filth, Aiden. You disgusting man. No, we won't put them there because it doesn't really make that much sense. We'll just do them on the big kind of overhangs. And in the spaces, um, I'm just, I'm just doing guesswork of placement at the minute. We might have to tweak them when we come to put the other big boys on. Um, excuse you. Yes, that's what I thought. Just what I thought. And then we'll overlap them with the ones that kind of look like that at the top. You know? Let's hope it comes in the same grey. Oh, it does. Oh, they're chunky. We all like a chunky... Right, stop it. Stop it! Oh, shit, shit. Now, now I was going to move the levels down to make it easier for me to place these, but I do need to see what we're doing. I really do. That's not too bad. The levels are okay. We are rising up a bit there. You raise me up. Not a time for songs. Especially of that shitty calibre. <laughs> I can't bear that song. I cannot. It reminds me of Westlife or some, something shit like that. I know it's not a Westlife song, but I'm sure they covered it. Westlife. Who remembers Westlife? Awful. Absolutely hideous. I was never, ever a boy band fan of any kind. Any, any kind. Yeah, that looks better. That does look better. We need some street lights coming along here. Maybe we'll do that now. We'll slap in a few street lamps. Um, of what have we got over there? We've got the traditional ones over there. So we'll do exactly the same to bring the lot or lots together. Together as one. Okay. Yes. Uh I think it was these ones, wasn't it? Did we use that over there? Yeah, they're kind of there. Are they? Hello. Yeah, they are. It is these ones. We have got one there. There is none coming up here, I don't think, though. So we're going to flop on down. We're going to put one there. Are we? Or there? No, not in front of the shop window, sweetie. There. And maybe like there. Oh, stunning. Oh, yes. Okay. And I think because there's outside seating here, I'm going to do a bit more than necessary bollard moments going on here. Just so they can't get any car through. And the same, we'll put another one. Does that one make sense there? I don't think it does because it's a lamppost there. So I'll move that one to there. Oh, there we go. And then we'll just space these out a little bit more. Um, Oh, this bloody street, the drain is in the way. Maybe if I just whistle it along a little bit. Whistle? Okay. I'm going to go with that word today. Whistle. <laughs> yeah, that looks better. That does look better. Oh, I am. I am, my loves. I'm here for that. Here for that. This is obviously going to be a little moment here. Um, would be, would have been nice to have this as a raised platform, but we're not going to do that. What would I see? What, what would you see? You would see like a... I know what fence would look great here. It's in my head. I know exactly what fence would look absolutely delicious here. And I can't see it. There it is. Maybe in that tone? Yeah, I think so. In that tone. And we'll do like a boop diddy boop A boop diddy do And then just a boop there. Like so. Oh, moist. Absolutely moist. Moist, moist, moist. All the moist. <laughs> All the moistness that there ever was to be moistened. <laughs> uh, laughing at my own jokes once again. <laughs> uh, do we do the same doors through the back? I think we will. Just to keep it uniform, pleasant and lovely. Should we do two? I think we shall. 
Yeah, we'll do two little moments there. Yeah, we can tuck this in now. Now, I'm not, now that I'm not going to be putting a kitchen area in, we'll just do literally a nice coffee bar. I mean, we might do some like bare. I would have loved to have had like a little dishwashing station and stuff, but this space here would just be too tight if I went, add, went to add one in. It's a shame, but I'm building for the lot and not necessarily out of realism for this one. So, so there. <laughs> Obviously, we need to do some toilets. We'll do the toilets upstairs. We can do the toilets like around here. here this is just going to be more seating anyway, so it doesn't really matter too much. Doesn't really matter too much, my loves. Right, out the front here, decoration-wise, we'll put in just some nice flower boxes. These would go well. If they came in tone, that would match in okay with the actual build. They match in. I think this is a little bit too large, though. I think this object is just one touch too large. Uh, so I always tend to size this one down. Lovely, though. Lovely. Did this come in a free update? Because this is base game, and I'd never, I never—I—I know it wasn't originally there, so it must have done. I answered my own flipping question. Stunning. Okay, and I think I'm going to add another street lamp. Can we put one there? Nope, because it blocks the whole fucking path. <laughs> we'll put one there. Oh, gorgeous. Oh, it's a bit it's a bit uh, integrated with the build, isn't it? We'll do it there. That's better. That's much better. Much more pleasant. Oh, yeah, I love the look of it. I do. I do, I do, I do. Yeah, I like the look of that. I'm thinking about doing some more signage on this side, maybe. So I'm going to just add in the same here. And the same just above. Just above it. Just above it. Once again, it's improved. Thank you so much for the, uh, the idea. Because I've snatched it from you. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of cute. Okay, right. We're going to make a start on the back area entrance now. Um, this part might be a little bit shorter. But as always, we'll probably spend a lot more time on the interior anyway next time. Which will be coming out tomorrow. So the day after that, you'll get this one. Which is, uh, which is lovely. Should we keep the sidewalk slabs? No. We're going to use... I know what we're going to do. We're going to use the same wood as what we're using on the inside. And I'm thinking that... Where is it? This one here, the curly wood. Oh, I always forget that this one is um, bugged, I think. I think it might be the bugged wood. We'll try it anyway. I think we'll do it in that direction, actually. Yeah, we'll do this wood. We'll do it all the way through. I love this wood. This is the curly wood from um, Island Living, I think. Yeah, Island Living. I mean, just look at that. Such a gorgeous, gorgeous like wood in The Sims 4. It really is. I hope to see more of that in the future. I really do. Yeah, and I'm thinking maybe just adding a couple of these back here as well. Just above the doors. One and two. There we go. Oh, lovely. Absolutely stunning. Stunning, stunning, stunning. Love everything about it. Hmm. Just trying to think. Outdoor Starbucks. They usually... It is just usually a table and chairs like this, really. In my neck of the woods. So maybe just doing a few more of these. No, the doors need to open. We might be able to squeeze three in here. Might. We might be able to. Let's get some more of these chairs coming through. Lovely. I'm just keep checking my audio levels as well, guys. I'm trying to, like, tweak my mic. Because in my past few speed builds, people probably won't notice this. But my audio has been off for some reason. And I've got a really expensive mic. So I am i don't know what's going on with it at the minute. I think I must have, like, tweaked something and made it a little bit weird. We could tuck that up there, actually. Yeah, we could. I'm, I'm going to do three chairs because it just makes it easier to place them on edges. Oh, I might be able to get four in here. Wouldn't that be absolutely delightful if we could? Uh, one there, maybe? I could maybe get a fourth chair on this one. Maybe. It's very close, isn't it? Maybe if I take away... Oh, that's going to leave me three, but... Yeah, if I take away that one... I'm going to move this. Could I do... Like, one there... And then 
another one there. No, that's going to look weird. But it will look weird. It's just not spaced out nicely for me. Okay. And then you can go back up where you came from. And maybe I'll... In fact, I know what I'm going to do. We're going to get rid of that one. We're going to put that to there. That to there. Let's get some more chairs on you, sweetie. Up there. Up there. Lovely jubbly. There we are. Stunning! We'll mirror that side over there. Look. Yes. There we go. There's one there. And then we'll do some two kind of table and chairs. Does that make sense? I hope so. We might um, have to change up the table and chair though. Oh, I could do stools. Oh, that fits in a dream, I tell you. Yeah, we'll do one there and then one up here. Ah, oh, they're not going to be able to sit there though. Maybe I'll do it like there. Yes, stunning. And then tables. Um, I always see these industrial ones in, but maybe go for this one. There we are. Lovely, lovely. And a lovely... And a jubbly. Is that giving me? Yeah, that's fine. Oh. Yeah, that's giving me the vibe. There needs to be some greenery around. There does. So I'm thinking maybe just putting a couple of potted plants. All right, come on. Starbucks vibes. Starbucks vibes. Just like a... Almost maybe topiary. Yeah, like this. That's very classic looking though. I don't enjoy the, the base of it. I wish what would you look like if I size you right down yes this is telling this is saying Starbucks to me yes that would that whispered Starbucks in my ear <laughs> Starbucks <laughs> I mean that doesn't make sense because it's not gonna be able to pull that out but we'll have to we'll have to offset it there to there there to there Yes, 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 yes. And we'll use the same rugs here. Oh, the same doormats. Sorry. There to there, look. Oh, that's glorious. Oh, I love it. And we'll do a nice little Starbucks signage just around the back. Just here. Now, did I do one on top there? I didn't. That doesn't really matter too much for up there. Okay. Well, I think what I'm going to do is add a chimney in somewhere. And I think we're done with this kind of exterior. I kind of enjoy that now. In the beginning, I hated the way that that all came out there. But I love the staggered look from like that angle. Love it. I do. I love it. Okay. Um, A little chimney moment. One of you, maybe. Maybe two of you in that darker tone. Yeah, like that. Oh, no. Because of the grey, it needs to be a little bit. A little bit more along those lines. Let's have a look. Yeah, that one. One and two. So we'll do one there and another one there. Um, no, they're not the right ones. I didn't get that vibe. I didn't, it didn't speak to me then. It needs to speak to me. Maybe this one in a grey. Let's have a look. I'm unsure if I'm going to size this down just yet. It might be okay. But let me have a look. Yeah, that's better. That, that took a little while to click in my head then, but that fits in better to me. Yeah, not bad at all. Not bad. So there we go, my friends. The Starbucks is coming along. I like the exterior to it. I really do. I think it's cute. I'm here for it. Next time, so tomorrow, I will see you all tomorrow. Don't you worry, I, bitches. I have got you. I have got you, okay? We're going to be seeing each other tomorrow. So obviously, we'll make a start on all the interiors um yeah we'll make a start on the interior tomorrow and don't forget to give me some ideas as well for this area over here remember it needs to be kind of not too much detail so it can't be like another retail street or something but it's got to be maybe a cinema or something you know it needs to be usable this is the community area and we've already got something that's not really usable apart from weddings and that's the church this is going to be obviously retail. This is going to be retail as well. I'm going to do another retail kind of shop there. I'm unsure of what yet. But this area here needs to be something that the Sims can use as a community lot. But we will not take up too much detail. 
I look forward to hearing your responses. Um, but yeah. Oh, it looks cute. It looks even cute in like that. Can't wait to get some more higher builds on this side. These two here are going to be another like three-story build. It might even make sense to do this as a one. <gasps> what about like a little mini... Oh, see, I'm going off on my head now. No, no. I was going to say like a mini department store. Oh, that's what that could be. That could be a department store. What do you think of that idea? Let me know down in the comments below. <laughs> Let me know. But anyway, my friends, I'm going to leave you here. Thank you so much, as always, for being an amazing, inspiring, friendly, weird, and hilarious bunch of people. I really appreciate it. It makes making these videos a joy to me. It really does. But anyway, my guys, my guys, my guys, I see you all tomorrow. <laughs> Bye.